Good morning! My name is Ali Isabel Z. Karyaga, your math tutor for today. Our lesson for today is subtraction. What is subtraction? Subtraction is one of the four basic arithmetic operations. In mathematics, we can observe the applications of subtraction in our everyday life in different ways. For example, when we purchase fruits and vegetables for a certain amount of money, say 100 pesos, and we have given a 200 pesos noted to the vendor. Now the vendor returns the excess amount by performing subtraction, such as 200 minus 100 equals 100. Then the vendor will return 100 pesos. I will show you how to subtract without regroupings and subtract with regroupings. Let's start! Subtraction without regrouping. Number problem. Our first equation is 579 minus 415. 9 minus 5 equals 4. 7 minus 1 equals 6. 5 minus 4 equals 1. So our answer is 164. Let's go to the second equation. 135 minus 724. 5 minus 4 equals 1. 3 minus 2 equals 1. 9 minus 7 equals 2. Our answer to number 2 problem is 211. Our third equation is 612 minus 101. 2 minus 1 equals 1. 1 minus 0 equals 1. 6 minus 1 equals 5. Our answer is 511. Let's go to the word problem. Number one, Ia has 54 apples and Alonso has 12. How many more apples does Ia have than Alonso? 54 minus 12 equals 4 minus 2 equals 2. 5 minus 1 equals 4. So our answer is 42. Apples. Number 2. Joyce bought 2 kilos of jasmine rice for 100 pesos. She also bought 1 kilo of beef for 300 pesos. If she has 500 pesos, how much remaining money does she has? 100 plus 300 equals 0 plus 0 equals 0 0 plus 0 equals 0 1 plus 3 equals 4 so the answer is 400 500 minus 400 equals 0 minus 0 equals 0. 0 minus 0 equals 0. 5 minus 4 equals 1. So the answer is 100. Subtraction with regrouping. 705 minus 429 equals to 5 minus 9 cannot be. So we will borrow to tens. But also, it cannot be. So, we will borrow to 7, and this will be 6. And then, this will be 10. Now that 1s will borrow to the number 2 tens, now, so it will be 15. So, this will be 9. 15 minus 9 equals 6. 9 minus 2 equals 7. 
6 minus 4 equals 2. Now, our final answer is 276. 810 minus 584 equals 2. 0 minus 4 cannot be. So, we will borrow to tens and the tens will be 0. And this will be 10. It will be 6. In this, the tens will borrow to hundreds. So, the tens, I mean the hundreds, will be 7. And this will be 10. 2. And 7 minus 5 equals 2. So, our final answer is 226. 117 minus 623 equals 7 minus 3 equals 4. And 1 minus 2 equals it cannot be. So we will borrow to hundreds and this will be 8 and this will be 11. 11 minus 2 equals 9. 8 minus two, 6 equals equals 2. So, our final answer is 294. Subtraction with regrouping. Word problem. Teacher Bell has 54 students. If 15 students were absent during the day, how many students were present? 54 minus 15 equals 4 minus 5 cannot be. So, we will borrow to tens and tens will be 4. And then the ones will be 14. 9. And this will be 3. So, the answer is 39. Number 4. Edward has 1,000 pesos. He gave Joyce 450 pesos and Aliyah 240 pesos as her daily allowance. How much is the remaining money of Edward? 1,000 minus 450 0 minus 0 equals 0 0 minus 5 cannot be He'll borrow to hundreds. Zero minus four cannot be. So the thousand will be zero. And the number hundreds will be ten. So the ten will the tens will be able to borrow to number hundreds. So this will be nine. This will be 10. 5. five. Now our 240. 0 minus 0 equals 0. 5 minus 4 equals 1. 5 minus 2 equals 3. Now our final answer is 200. 310, 310 pesos.